Okay, my face hat because I look like a different person in every no, photo. No, that is not what I mean. I mean, just there's a lot, you know, you, you know, you're, you're, you're a glamour. What, what, what yes. was it like? Because you said like you knew it was going to be a huge hit. I mean, I guess you really have Har Har Harvey Weinstein to like thank for this, right? Um, app, yeah, yes, Anthony, give me the right, give me the foot. Yeah. Um, yes, I definitely, de I'm, I don't have, I didn't have a problem with him personally. He never was at disrespect, nothing like that. I, you know, I don't really even want to touch on him, but, um, yeah, you know, again, I married the spawn of the devil that I worked for, and then, you know, it's a lifestyle of one. And I'm not saying, He's the devil, but I'm saying there's a lot of devils around. You know what I mean? And in, in ways you sell your soul and you sell yourself for that thing. Now, they didn't pay me enough to sell myself. Do you know what I mean? They didn't pay me enough to sell myself. And my relationship with God is so good. I was able to get my life back, you know. Um, but, yeah, there's a lot of people to think. I have to thank my sister and I don't want it either. <laughs> you know what I mean? There's, there's, there's a lot I have to thank the girls and who wants to do that <laughs> you know so we all we all had we're all to thank we all did a tremendous job tremendous production um you know Adam Talani Nina like they we they they all and this is only of recent that I feel like I have to thank everybody I you know watching the reboot uh, not the reboot now that it's streaming, whatever stream, I, I, listen, I'm just learning how to use an iPhone. I don't even, right now we're on my Android because I refuse to use an iPhone, but wow. I'm just learning now. Yeah. Yeah. So they're streaming now, um, which we have nothing to do with. Hello, Hollywood. I wish I would have read those contracts again. <laughs> wish I would have read those. Um, but they're streaming. So. I had to do an event last night in Long Island and there was probably I four or 500 people and I got on stage and they were like, Renee Graziano of my wife. And I can't tell you, I was like, it, they still clapping and still knowing and taking pictures and still asking questions. I'm sorry. And what do you need? Um, okay. One minute, baby. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh, it's okay. Wait, you can put your shoes on. Would you touch? iPhone. Now it says emergency. I don't even know what to. It says we can't touch it for a minute. Yeah, I think it just it'll go back in like a minute. Okay. I don't you just can't work. enter it for now. So, um, yeah, it was it last night. I realized Mob Wives had a really huge impact. Huge impact. We are now off television. We're in twenty three. We ended like in seventeen. Right, that's what. Yeah, six years. So we're going on seven years. Um, yeah. right, seven years. Angela passed away. The seventeenth, uh, the seventeenth of February, I believe. Like in seventeen, I have to, I have to check. But huge. The women are still clapping. Questions. The love in the room. Are you talking to this one? Are you talking to that? Like, I was like, no, no, no. Nope, I'm still me. <laughs> so you don't keep that first, the core season, like Karen, Drita, Carla, you don't talk to any of them. Now you're breaking up again. You're like silent. Let me see, I can't, oh, I think you muted yourself. I don't know uh -huh. how, oh, there you are. Yeah. Yeah, I did. I was like, I was right, right when I ask who you still speak to, <laughs> you should end it on that note. Be like, and then, um, I talked to Carla. She lives in Florida. I talked to Karen. I've spoken with Ramona. I do not speak with Drita. Um, she's probably the only one I don't talk to. I don't see love. I, I mean, there's people that I don't see and speak to, but for the most part. I've apologized to the women that I needed to apologize to. So Alicia, Natalie, I apologize. I had a lot of cleaning up to do after um, that other girl, Renee, came around because she was a little bit crazy, that one. 
not crazy, just everybody was against me. So I'm very defensive. And they were against me because they had issues with my sister. But who, how are you going to take it out on her? That's your boss. So you're going to take it out on the one that's on TV. And that's what you saw. How is this you saw me constantly battling what you didn't see behind, you know, the, the scenes. So that that bickering had way more to do with her than it did with me. Right. And that's not on you. I mean, she's, you know, you're still a cast member. She's the producer and creator. So that has nothing to do with you. Right. Right. But, you know, after the show, like, I kind of, you know, it's so funny. Everybody kind of spilled the beans afterwards. So, so much of everybody's silence is golden. You know what I mean? So I think everybody, I had, I, I'm just finding things out now. And I'm like, that's why I said should have read those contracts a little better. Like I'm literally just finding out now what was happening around me. I was just showing up sometimes, um, sometimes not in the right state of mind. Um, but for the most part, I was showing up as Renee Graziano, as the person that they hired um, and the person who has always really been her. You know, so I, I was showing up as me, but not realizing it was take that out of minute, it was causing a chaos, a bigger chaos in my world than um than it was before. I was I was the cause of chaos. You got who who was the hardest to apologize out of your castmates to apologize to? Um I think they, they they all were. They were all equally. There was Anthony, John. They were all equally. I did something wrong to each one of them on a, on an equal level. So Natalie and I, that physical altercation, that I had to apologize to myself for that. I had to yeah. apologize to myself. And that's probably been the hardest. That's the hardest person. Yeah. Myself. Good, good question. <laughs> I you, was the hardest cast member to apologize to myself. Did you try to apologize to Drita and she just didn't want it? Correct. There's, I, I got, there's, no, your mother said if you can't say nothing nice, say nothing. I'm learning that one too. I, you know, when I, when I first came around and got sober, I, sent her a text message because there was no communication. Um, however, there's a little bit of a bad feeling. She didn't come to my father's wake and regardless of well, who's talking or not, that's, you know, that was a little upsetting. Not for me, because that was really never my friend, but my sister, you know what I mean? Like everybody was mad over money, money. Like it was like, everybody's mad over money, but, um, which is the devil and another devil. It's like what you said. Listen, you know. It, well, I was going to say, it's like what you said. Like, you know, reality TV people, everyone wants it. Everyone thinks they want that fame. And it's like at the end 